What's up guys, Awesome Nerd Show here, and today we are unboxing the new uh, Legion of Collectors box. And as you can see, it's got Joker's um, head or whatever silhouette there on the front. And so the theme for this box is Batman villains. Um, I don't know if that's exactly what it's called or not, but um, that's what it's dealing with. So super excited about this. Cannot wait to see what's in here. Hopefully we get some new or um, maybe remakes of some old villains that are hard to find now. Uh, but I cannot wait because... Um, I'm a huge fan of Batman, but I am through his villains. Like, I think the villains are amazing and um, like a lot of them, and so that's why I'm a fan of Batman, because you can't have villains without Batman. Um, but first off, we have our patch and pin, and so the patch for this month is Bane, or Bane's face, I guess. And then, it, of course, says uh, Legion of Collectors and stuff on there, which that's really awesome. And then the pin, which it's going to be hard to see, um, oh, I guess there's a hole in it, um, but it's got Riddler on it, and it just says Riddler, and then Legion of Collectors, which is really awesome, comes, um, the Riddler is one of my favorite villains, considered a lame one, but I really enjoy him, um, so this is loaded with stuff, um, so of course we have our first, or like an advertisement thing, um, so first thing we have is the Batman comic. It's a Batman, and then it says Riddler number one <laughs> written on top of it. But it looks like 30 or 23.2. I don't know if that has to do with anything or what. But of course you have a Riddler on there with a Robin tie or Robin over here tied up and stuff, and Batman in the background there flying around. So that is really a really awesome picture. But I'd, again, I don't know what issue of Batman this is, but it doesn't really matter. But it's still really cool. So that's our first thing. There's a lot of stuff in here. Um, so I guess we'll go with this, which again, it is another mug, which um, the mugs aren't that great and stuff and kind of tired of uh, Funko putting them in boxes and stuff. But this one is of the Joker. Of course, it has its uh, pop head, so that's why it's got the really weird swirl eyes and everything. Oh, I can't get it out. But they just have these giant mugs that are like can't use for anything stuff but it looks really cool though but as you can see it's got the jokers um, head and stuff with his swirly eyes and his actual white uh, teeth and everything um, but that is cool I guess but again don't know what we're going to do with that um, but we'll figure something out uh, next up we have a Dorbs and it is of Two-Face which is really cool because I'm not um, seen Two-Face yet which I don't of course, there's no real advertisements on here uh, to see if there's any others, but um, sound if you can tell over here, like on the shelf, we have all the Batman characters that they've made so far in Dorp. So this is another one to add to it, which is really cool. And so here is Two-Face. As you see, he's got his Harvey Dent side over here with the where he's normal and stuff. And he does have a little tiny coin. It's going to be hard to see, but in his hand there, which is cool. And then, he, of course, he has his... Um, what is like burnt side or whatever from the acid and his um, makes him two face or whatever. So, so that's really cool. I love this. Definitely glad they put this in here and it'll be going on the shelf with all the other Batman characters and stuff over there. Um, next up we have a hat um, which I, when I saw the colors I um, was hoping it was going to be the Riddler or something because if it was I would actually wear this hat but it's um, the Joker of course, that was the mug and everything. And so it's got all the purple in it and stuff, and then it's got the Joker cards there on the back. Um, I still really like this like uh, gray color, and then um, I'm a fan of purple, so I may actually wear this hat when I very seldomly ever do wear hats, but um, I wish it had been a lot cooler if the Riddler was on there because they still could have done the same colors. But Anyways, and so our final thing in the box, which is the pop, um, which is kind of cool, but it is the old Catwoman. Um, I'm not sure if this is from the 66 show, because it doesn't have any of the um, 66 Batman logos or anything on it, or if this is just supposed to be the very first uh, Batgirl, or version of Batgirl from the, or sorry, keep saying Batgirl, I meant Catwoman, uh, from the comics. Um, but as you can see here, she's of course in her all purple outfit, which is a cl her classic version or whatever. And she has her whip in her hand, which of course she's known for having. And then in this she has, a, of course, a green cape on and everything and her cat ears and all that. So that's really cool. Um, definitely not a um, 
pop I'd expect or anything, but it's still really cool that they made it because always, again, all the um, Batman characters are really cool. So I, no, I probably get that in there. So that is it for the box this month, and I'll just kind of show this to you so you can see um, the lid and inside the box has all sorts of the villain pictures in there and stuff. So that's a really cool inside the box there. And so next month, or I guess in January, it's the theme is DC Legacy. So of course I assume it's got um, really old versions of stuff. Um, I guess we'll never know. I don't know what they mean by legacy and stuff. But the box of course is Batman on. So hopefully there will be a lot of cool stuff in there. Um, let's see. And so of course we have the items on the back here. And of course they're all just um, the stuff you saw. But I did see that the comic here is a um, remake of the um, Riddler comic that you can see down there. Which I actually do have so that's... Uh, cool to have that one so that's the old uh, Batman comic and not the new one that's currently out so um, that's really cool to have that comic again me being a Riddler fan and stuff it's cool to get a Riddler comic I wish there was more Riddler in here or brand new characters or something but anyway that's it for the Legion of Collector um, box this month be sure to hit that like button if you enjoyed leave any comments you have down below hit the red subscribe button to check out all our unboxings and we'll see you next time